Hi, welcome to Asian Beauty Secrets. As you can see from today's title, it's gonna be slightly different. And I think all of you guys out there would wanna know because I know for guys out there, it takes a lot of courage to finally ask a girl of your dreams out. And trust me, us girls, before a date, we go through like minor panic attacks. Here it is. I have compiled a list of must knows before going on an awesome date. We as humans, we rely quite heavily on our scent. It, it actually alters our mood, you know, what we want to do, our desire to do certain things or eat certain foods. Please, boys and girls out there, take a shower. Take a shower before you go out. Especially girls, I mean, if you have the time, go and take a bath. Bath is not only soothing, it's calming, it's, it helps to nourish your skin, it also increases the blood circulation, um, it also helps to produce more endorphins, which makes you happy, but also at the same time it reduces water retention and inflammation, so you actually get rid of any bloating and things like that. So I mean guys, you can take a bath too, but you know, seriously, a little overkill. What I find through all the experiences of date is that at the end of the day, trust me, the guys are not going to notice the fact that you use three colors and you blend them gradually to create, create a gradient of color or that the fact that you matched your nail polish with your blush, with your lipstick. What I would suggest is just to be simple, be natural, be comfortable in what you're wearing. I mean, if you usually wear a smoky eye and you usually like a heavy makeup, then obviously you know, you're, you're comfortable with that, then do that. If you usually don't wear any makeup, then don't wear any makeup. If you were to wear one thing, Definitely wear some mascara because you want it to define the eyes. If you have nothing else to say, just flutter your lashes. Right? That's what I do. For guys out there, definitely, definitely remember lip balm. When you're talking to somebody, they're just going to be looking at the dry skin that's going to fall off your lip. Nothing is more unattractive than dry, crackly lips. And for girls out there, this is a really important tip. Try to avoid sticky gloss. I mean, yes, they look amazing on your lips, but you know, you have the hair flying in your face and you're going to have to be doing all these ugly faces where you're trying to grab the hair from your face. Why would you need a sticky gloss? You could just, just natural is good. Sometimes just a bit of lip balm or a lip stain. I, I prefer lip stains on first dates because it lasts longer. Okay, now moving on to the most important part out, out of a date, which I know because we all freak out about this, is what to wear, right? Not only have we rated our own wardrobes, we probably rated our sisters or our mothers and our friends, and still at the end of the day, we don't know what to wear. And usually on a first day, my room will look like something, a hurricane came in and swept out of my closet and just unraveled everything. Even guys too, I, I've actually known a friend who, who goes through seven outfits before going on a date. So the main suggestion that I can give you is that at the end of the day, they're, ask, they're asking you out not because of what you're wearing. They like you for who you are. So to better show who you are is to better be comfortable in what you're wearing. So if you are a t-shirt and jeans girl, do it. If you are a sundress and you know high heels, do that. I mean, nothing is more attractive than wearing a layer of confidence. When you're uncomfortable in what you're wearing, it shows off in your face, it shows off in your body language and they can feel it too. And when you're uncomfortable, they're uncomfortable and it makes the whole situation uncomfortable. On to the next thing is hair. Please wash your hair. I mean, it, it's, it's going to be a really nice gesture that you, you showed appreciation and effort towards the state that you've washed your hair. Especially, you know, if you want to lean in a little bit, you have to worry, oh my God, is he going to smell my hair? because probably he will smell your hair. You want to look like you're more relaxed, you're more yourself. For me, I like to leave it down on a date. You can, you can like play around with it, you can look more natural, but don't constantly do this you know, every five minutes because you look retarded. If you like to you have your hair up, then have your hair up. If you like to have your hair in pigtails, do that, braids, whatever you like. Guys, don't over gel your hair. Us girls, we, we go through 50 outfits and at the end of the day, you realize you're like half an hour late or sometimes two hours late, I don't know. But to me, I think the, the, the best thing is to be punctual. It's a really big sign of respect and it's not, sometimes it's only five minutes, 10 minutes. It's not about the actual time. It's, it's a gesture that makes a difference. Okay, last but not least is always do three checks, three checks before you go out the door. First one, breath check. So I always suggest brush your teeth before you leave the house and always carry some mitts. Number two, lipstick check. That's how you do a lipstick check because whatever is around your finger is what will show up on your teeth. Last check is body check. You make sure you smell nice, make sure your hair smells nice. So always bring like a little deodorant uh, or you know perfume spray with you. It's gonna do you wonders. Right, this is just some tips to make sure that you have a successful awesome date without having all of these problems getting in the way of getting to know each other more. Me personally, 
Um, I have quite an oily face and I always, um, I'm always shiny all the time. I don't like that look and I don't think it looks very attractive either. So I always bring with me my, my blotting paper, but this is optional because not everyone has oily skin like me. But this is just for me to show you what I would definitely, definitely bring with me on a date.